Here's Doak's kick again, same general vicinity, and Owen Wright will get another chance. He's at the 2, 10, 15, 18, upfield of the 20 with a nice move and a hard hit. Out to the 26-yard line. Back for the first time in a couple weeks, and the Tribe are going to have to stop him today, as they do right there. Yeah, nice job, Gang Green tackling for the green and gold. As Roger goes with an empty backfield, back to pass. Dean rolls to his right and will run the football. He's got four or five, cuts it upfield, and falls forward across the 40, nearly for a first down. Yeah, you hit that big hitter as we take a shot deep down the field here for Chris Conlon. He's got it. He's got it at the 20 and the 10. Caught behind the five-yard line. Chris Conlon has uh, come alive in the last couple of weeks. Caught four balls last week. To the near side, Nick Muse at the tight end position. He's all alone over here. Roger looking his way and floating the ball towards Nick. Reaches up, makes the catch. Touchdown, William and Mary. Touchdown, Green and Gold. Nick Muse was lined up as the tight end, one on one, and he had the side. So a fumble and a bobble, the last two plays offensively for Maine, and yet it's third down and two. They'll hand off the football, bounces around, and they will stop him. Edwards now a couple of catches and nearly 80 yards as they'll hand the football off on the right side, trying to get him in the backfield, and Gavin Johnson does. Now they go that way, and that ball's going to be intercepted. Down the line it goes at the 30. He's at the 40-yard line. Got one man to beat the quarterback. He skips around him, and that's going to be a touchdown, William and Mary. Touchdown, green and gold. Wow, Armand Jones with a 90-yard pick, and the Tribe has taken the lead. Armstrong and Jalen Christian over here. He'll run it to the left. Quarterback will keep it. And with a nice uh, juke move, gets about seven yards. First and 10, Maine, 28 yard line. Tribe leading 14 to 10. Clock running, 10 minutes left in the first half. Hand off right side, the Tribe pursues and falls in to get some unceremoniously. That's a great play by Zyquan Vassant out of Norfolk, a true freshman with a big takedown. At the 44-yard line into William & Mary territory are the main Black Bears. Ferguson rolls to his right, going to go deep. He's got a man, Micah Wright. That ball's going to be popped up in the air and incomplete. Corey Parker has been in it all day long. He's around the action. The junior out of Haymarket knocks the ball away. Snaps a good one, and the punt is away. Line drive punt. Jack will take it. Run backwards to the 15, across the field of the 20, upfield of the 25, and he's upended at the 30-yard line. Here's a screen play to Nate Evans, and Nate will get close to a first down. Second down and four, he has to come out of the game, Conlon does, because he lost his helmet. There's a throw over the middle, complete to Nick Muse. 19th catch of the year for Nick Muse, and that'll move the chain. Three wide outs of the game, one of those guys in motion now. Quarterback Ferguson will hand the ball in the belly of the running back, Jefferson, who's hemmed up in the backfield and finally taken down. Thought he was going to break away again, but he gets back to the line of scrimmage. Josh Delaney did the job stopping him. Ferguson back to pass. Throwing over the middle, complete, and Josh Delaney again. Right on top of the Micah Wright, the receiver, and the main Black Bears will be forced to put it away. And now it's Ted Hefter. It's Ted Hefter's team throwing it downfield. He's got a man complete. That is Muse, 35, 40. He's making some news out of bounds at the 20-yard line. The kick is up. It is long enough, and it is Good! A 36-yard field goal by Chris Hooper. 
He nailed one at Virginia Tech about that yardage, 35 yards, and nails one on homecoming here and ties the game up with five minutes and 31 seconds remaining in the third quarter. Homecoming here at William & Mary. Ferguson back to pass, lofting it towards the end zone. Ball knocked up in the air, incomplete. Corey Parker and Isaiah Lassiter all there. They will think uh, they will hand the football to Jefferson. They get it behind the line of scrimmage. Great job of that defensive front line. Big play here. Left side going downfield. That's Owen Wright with a first down inside the 50 and down to the 45 yard line. Mr. Official move those chains. First and 10, Owen Wright. 17 17. Third down. Keeping it alive, over the middle, complete. That is Tyler Klaus, number 82, the big six foot four junior with a nice catch and a roll. Back to pass the quarterback, throwing it right side. Five, one, touchdown, William and Mary. Touchdown, green and gold. Ted Hefter threw another strike. Fitzpatrick is beside the quarterback, and the quarterback chased by Bill Murray, and Bill Murray's going to drive him into the turf. First and 10 of the 37-yard line. Ferguson back to pass. Looking over the middle, intercepted by Delaney at the 40, hit down at the 31-yard line. Josh Delaney has played the game of his life. Ted Hefter up the middle, he's got seven, he's got eight, and he slides forward past the first down marker, I think. Good job by Parker coming up, throwing that one big right hand out of Bill Murray, another big tackle for Ross, a five yard loss in the backfield. Three down linemen for the tribe, Micah Wright in motion, Ferguson, can't get away, he is decked in the backfield at the 48 yard line. Guess who? Big Bill Murray. One of the top rate teams in the country. Fourth down and eight. Ferguson stepping up in the pocket. He's going to throw it late. Ball in the air. Picked off for a try. Trump's going to win it. Picked off by William and Mary. Isaiah Laster tosses the ball up in the air. And William and Mary has come up with a big defensive play on a day of many big defensive plays. Get one more snap off. We're going to secure this win. Head coach Jimmy Laycock with his 248th career win at the helm of William & Mary. It'll be the Tribe's 14th win in the last 20 homecoming games. Hey,